everyone, my name's Michelle and this is my channel Sewing Bunny. Thank you so much for joining me in my video today, which is my So Haley Jane October unboxing. So I have the box here all ready to show you all the goodies inside. You can see that I have already opened it <laughs> because I'm far too impatient to wait and then film. I've literally just got in from work. Um, if anyone's wondering, I'm wearing my Tilly and the Buttons fray top and in this uh, gorgeous fabric this I got from Andrea from Beyond the Pink Door it's just so happy and cheery I love wearing uh, this this top it's really really nice and it's getting a little bit cold so the long sleeves really do help with that <laughs> So um, for anyone that doesn't know, I subscribe to the Classic Box, which is the middle tier of the So Haley Jane subscription boxes. I will link So Haley Jane um, uh, Haley's website down below uh, if you are interested in kind of looking at the different uh, subscriptions. I do have a discount code, which I've mentioned before. If you want to try a box, if you um, haven't tried one before, you get 10% off your first box if you go on the link below, use the code MICHELLE10 at checkout, you get 10% off your first box and also I get a little uh, bit of commission as well. I do pay for my subscriptions for So Holy Jane but that's just a little discount there so a little bit win-win. So you want to see what's inside the box. <laughs> so I love this box, I think it's such a good one. Um, so when you open up the box you are always greeted with some lovely yellow tissue paper. I just love that it's yellow, it's just so bright and just like a little ray of sunshine. So every box comes with a theme each month and this theme, I was so excited. <laughs> it's called Dream A Little Dream <laughs> and look at this lovely rainbow. So you instantly think kind of like all oh, like magical like things you know kind of maybe like stars or or something like that um just something really happy I'm thinking so um when you go into the magazine I will just do a quick run through you get a little introduction from Hayley she kind of tells you a little bit about uh, kind of like the inspiration behind the box and also about what's included uh, we've got an interview here with um Adaku Parker, who looks after the um, shop Dovetailed. So they have uh, like African wax prints and things in there. Um, also talks about her new book as well. Uh, we've got a make of the month, which is Rachel. So she's made some lovely bits there. And then we have three boxes, three makes. So I don't share with you um, the boxes uh, for the classic and the mini because otherwise it gives away what fabric I've got and I like to leave that at the end <laughs> but uh, we've got Esther and she had the mini box and she has made up a McCall's top which looks lovely um, we have Gemma I can show you Gemma's because Gemma had the luxury box and uh, she made the Fr Friday Pattern Company Davenport dress which looks lovely there. Uh, you guys may know that I have uh, made the Davenport dress and uh, I really, really like it, but I like hers because she hasn't put the sleeves on. She's made it sleeveless, which I think is lovely. And isn't this gorgeous, this color, really pretty. I think it's an art gallery they put in the luxury box, which looks gorgeous. And then you've got Laura who had the classic box and she made the Anthea blouse by Anna Allen. And that looks lovely too. Right, let's see what else we've got. Oh yes, we've got Tamlin from Sewn on the Time. She's got a lovely little step-by-step uh, -step guide on making some removable, uh, removable, <laughs> reusable uh, makeup wipes and a pouch using some of the fat quarters that are in this box. I think that's gorgeous. That would make such a lovely gift for somebody. I really like that idea. And uh, yeah, she does give you a step-by-step -step guide on that. And then we've got a little section in here from Victoria from Little Rosy Cheeks, just about um, uh, how to like attach labels into garments, which is really, really helpful. I did actually meet Victoria from Little Rosy Cheeks when I went to the knitting and stitching show. She was lovely. It was so nice to meet her. And um, yeah, so uh, there is also a little item from her in the box. <laughs> 
And then we've got Hayley's little links where she's just sharing about what she's uh, kind of really into at the moment. She's actually got um, a book in here which is Where the Crow Dads Sing. I've actually got that um, on my um, Audible, uh, Amazon Audible list. So I have actually got that downloaded, ready to listen to, because I tend to uh, do audio books more than I do physical books, because I just don't have time to read with all my other hobbies. So when I drive to and from work, it takes me about 45 minutes to an hour to uh, drive to work and another 45 minutes to an hour to get home. So good time to uh, get some uh, Audible in there with some audiobooks. <laughs> And then we've got a So Holy Jane subscriber profile, which is Vicky. So she's made some lovely items there. And then some pattern picks from the fold line. And then the Makers Gallery, where you get to see all the um, some inspiration and things and also anyone you want to follow. I was really excited actually to see this lovely lady here, who you, I'm sure you know, is Ruan from the Yorkshire Sew so Girl. I love her channel. If you haven't seen her channel, you have to go and visit because she is just one of those people that puts the camera on and she just chats away and you just feel like you've known her for years. <laughs> I really like her channel and I really hope to uh, hopefully one day meet up with her because uh, yeah, I just love her. So uh, yes, hello Ruan if you're watching. <laughs> so that's the magazine. So let's show you all the goodies. So you always get a sweet treat. And oh, I love these Milky Way Magic Stars. So those I will just consume as soon as I've finished recording. And we've also got a little Notion, which is some snap fasteners. I think actually we had some snap fasteners in fasteners in uh, So Holy Jane box uh, a few months back. And I have to admit, I haven't used this type because I think this type is more kind of like the hidden sort of snap fastener. So if you've got, you know, like maybe a uh, like a wrap top or something, you just want to kind of clip it a little bit more together. That's kind of what those I believe are for. And then, um, as I mentioned, uh, Victoria from Little Rosy Cheeks um, has put an item in the box and I love these. These are some of her labels and they're called You Deserve to Dream. Aren't they gorgeous? They're so nice. And if you haven't um, tried any of the Little Rosy Cheeks labels, I do really recommend them. I've got quite a few different ones and they are really soft. They're not scratchy at all. Um, they are so like nice quality. I think that if you haven't had labels before in your garments, these are a great way to, to start. And also I've got a little cheeky discount code that she has put in there. Obviously I can't show you the code, but it's on this little bit of card. So I will definitely be using that. And then we have the fat quarters. And I don't know if you can hear Misty meowing at me through the door. I'm trying to do at least one vlog where she doesn't just get in the way. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm sorry Misty I'll come get you in a minute um these fat quarters are gorgeous you have this lovely kind of lilac-y purple with these I think are they like little they kind of look like leaves kind of designs really really pretty colour and then um we've also got this one which is gorgeous those lovely sort of like marble sort of colours really really pretty I think I'm going to have to let her in because she's now scratching at the door. I watched uh, Ruan's So Holy Jane unboxing video. If you haven't seen that, watch that. Her cat, uh, Tigger, interrupted and she mentioned about my cat, Misty. And on cue, hey, hang on. Right, uh, so the other fat quarters. This is absolutely gorgeous as well. This one is um, got like flowers and, oh, you can't see from that side. It's got unicorns on. How beautiful are they? And there's all this kind of like glitteriness sort of in the fabric. It's so pretty. And I think the glitter, I'm not sure if it's kind of, I'm not sure if it's that sort of glitter that would come off. It seems quite embedded in there. But oh, I love unicorns. They're so pretty. And then uh, this one as well, which um, has lots of these gorgeous unicorns on as well. 
really, really nice. So it seems we can't go um, doing a vlog without Misty uh, interrupting, it does seem. We're almost there. <laughs> uh, so also we get a matching Gutemann thread to the main fabric. Look at that colour. Isn't it gorgeous? I was so happy with this colourway because there are two colourways. There's this colour and there is also blue. I'm so glad that I got this colour. This is definitely a more me colour, I think. It is a double gauze and oh, look at that. It is absolutely gorgeous, this lovely sort of mauve colour. And if you can see, there are also these little white butterflies on. They are so pretty and I love double gauze. I have made quite a few items in double gauze. So uh, yes, you like that box, don't you? Um, <laughs> I love double gauze. Um, one of my favourite patterns is the Coco Wawa Crafts Honeycomb dress in double gauze. Also the Whisper Blouse um, by Wardrobe by Me. That is a gorgeous pattern for um, double gauze. I was kind of thinking, I'm not 100% sure what I would make from this because I love the colour, but I'm thinking with the butterflies on it, I don't know if it would be better as a top or a dress. So I'm thinking maybe it might be quite nice as the um, Megan Nielsen Darling Range, um, Darling Ranges dress. I thought that might be quite nice for it. Maybe get some like little white buttons down the front to kind of go with the little butterflies. I thought that might be quite nice. And also double gauze, I think is brilliant for all seasons. I think it's really nice and breathable and cool in the summer, but also because it is kind of all snuggly, then it's good for winter too. Now I'm hearing Bentley meowing at me. Obviously he thinks that he's missing out. So I think that is my cue to round up the video and uh, go get some dinner and feed these little guys. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please give me a thumbs up. If you subscribe to the So Holy Jane box, what are you planning on making with your fabric? I would love to know. So take care everybody and I'll speak to you all very soon. Bye.